Hello and welcome to the channel once again. The name is Guru Boa. Here in today's episode on how you can repair your device, we are going to take a deep dive on how we can remove Apple ID on our device. So um, in this tutorial, we need to meet certain criteria in order to turn off FMI on our device. So currently you see this device have my iPhone on and since we do not remember our previous password for this account we need to um, find a way to remove or turn off find my iPhone on our device so um, before we can um, remove find my iPhone on this device we need to meet certain um, criteria first is to um, move into your iCloud under settings apple id move into your icloud and make sure that um you can access icloud so when you do move into icloud make sure that the icloud storage do load and also click on show or show or icloud use uh, apps and make sure that you can um, toggle game center on and off so if you are able to toggle game center on and off without um, requesting for any password then you can follow along with this tutorial so um when i do toggle game center on you can see um game center did turn on without requesting for password which means we are good to go so after knowing that you, you and toggle game center on and off your um iCloud story do load then you can follow along with this tutorial so first then first we need to switch to our computer so here right over here on our computer we need this tool called the R resolve fmi tool so this tool is very powerful with one click to remove from my iCloud account on your device so first thing we need to do is to run the iResolve Prime and if you haven't downloaded it check this video description and I'll put a link for it in this video description so here we do have the iResolve Prime open menu being launched and now we need to plug in our iPhone to the computer and if you have been prompt to trust the device mm -hmm. just click trust and now um we have our phone details right over here you can see the iphone model os version serial number imia uid and one first thing you need to do is to move to the settings and make sure if you do have previous password that you did set with um three tools for um backing up your encrypted backup files you can change it since i don't have um, I just have to go with the default password which is 1234 and turn on encryption. After doing so, just click on FMI and if your device is not registered, you, you will see this um, pop-up message saying device is not being authorized. So we need to copy this um, serial number and send it to any reseller. So you can send me your serial number for registration and this tool is a paid tool not free so after copying your serial number and making a successful registration click on fmi off and you have this prompt saying move to settings um your apple id then move to icloud and we need to toggle game center off and on before we do proceed so just scroll down to you see game center and make sure to toggle it off then the second step is to toggle it on so let's toggle it on then after we've toggled it on we can now click on i'm ready and then proceed to the next step and um one thing you need to know is to you make sure that you do clear all media files on your device so the next step is to turn off wi-fi connection which i'm going to do it so after turning off wi-fi click on i'm ready and now wait for it to proceed to turn off fmi on your device so as i said you need to make sure that you back up all your media files and deleted it from your device 
in order to make this backup faster so my backup took three minutes so in order to have a successful rate a high success rate in turning off your fmi on your device make sure that you do delete media files on your device to make the backup faster so we can see um, we have successfully removed or turned off fmi on our device as we have the message right over here the model iphone xr name iphone uh you can see the clean status and we have code 200 removed successful rate so um now we can copy our serial number and make sure to check your serial number before you do erase or restore your device so here i'm going to um, check my serial number real quick and uh, after checking uh, we can proceed to the next step if we still do have fmi on we cannot proceed to erase our device so uh, okay so we have um fmi being turned off successfully so we cannot proceed to the next step by uh, erasing or restoring our device will so depend on the option that you want to go in for so here um, I'm going to use three tools to, in order to erase this device I'm not going to restore it since it's going to take a long a longer time to um, complete the restore so um, in three tools I move to um, toolbox then when you do move into two box move to erase all data and then proceed to erase your device so um i'll catch up with you guys on the activation lock screen so um if you are enjoying this video don't forget to hit on the like button and also new members on this channel make sure to subscribe to the channel so let's wait for our device to be erased successfully and we have it right over here our device has been erased successfully and now we can um, proceed to set up our device so let's proceed to set up our device okay so as i said these two link will be in this video description and um make sure to contact me when you need any registration and also you can visit um, um, smartunlock.org for all your GSM services like um, iCloud Bypass or Signal um, Carrier Unlock and other GSM service so you do see our device has been successfully um, activated without any iCloud for the activation lock screen so we just um, skip that since we've turned off FMI on our device and with this no need to worry about um, SIM calls and i services because this is permanently removing um, Apple ID or bonded Apple ID from your device so that is it for today's tutorial thanks for um watching this video and make sure to like if you really enjoy for new members make sure to subscribe to this channel thanks for watching the name is guru Bwai. peace out